The whole concept of active learning, I think, has been around for a long time. What we really are talking about is how we're using technology in terms of learning and how do we start thinking about learning, learning spaces, what we call active learning, in terms of integrating all of life into university and to learning. Learning doesn't just happen inside the classroom. It's as soon as you step onto campus, you're in an environment that's constantly inspiring you and inspiring teachers who are inspiring our students to develop more than just understanding of a curriculum, but developing life skills, developing as citizens and as the future of, of the workforce. A lot of um, spaces are just kind of still used in, I guess, a traditional teaching model. I think it's an idea whose time has come, and I think we've been very caught up in traditional modes of teaching because all of us, of course, who are academics, are successful because we came through the old system, we did well in it, so we're now going to perpetuate it. And this has been my experience in a couple of courses that have been run in the new spaces. A lot of people aren't quite sure about how to use them. If the technology is there but nobody's been trained in how to use it, then it's just not going to be used. What's great about days like this is we make everyone aware there are different ways to do it and that this may actually not only be better for the student learning, it might actually be more fun for the academic requires a partnership between the academics, the schools, the faculties in the central area to actually make it work. I had a couple classes in my first year in one of these new active learning classrooms. It was just a lot of collaborative work, a lot of group work. It was something a bit different from your usual sit down in rows. It was um, very engaging and just interesting. So much of education is changing so rapidly. We know what our expectations are, we know what kind of skills we want to develop, we know what kind of learning experience we want to have, um, and you know, students are the experts. Now these real life scenarios that we can create, we can actually bring the workplace here into the university right from the first year. And so it embeds all kinds of other skills into what we're teaching. So we're teaching content, but on the periphery, we're teaching all of these other skills that we want them to have when they leave us and go into the workplace.